Okay, so hello, hello. Well, well, let's wait. Okay, hello, hello, guys. Welcome. Welcome to the hello. class. <laughs> Hi. How are you today, guys? How are you? Fine. Fine. That's pretty cool. So, well, guys, today we have a very interesting class, okay? So, welcome. We are going to wait for some of your, you know, classmates to join, okay? So, let's wait for them. Wow. Let me just look for the materials, okay? Just one second, guys. Okay. It perfect. So welcome everybody. So today we have a very interesting class. We are going to learn a lot, okay? But first of all, I want to ask you guys, do you finish the homework? Do you finish it? Yes. Perfect. I want to hear that. Yes, that's pretty cool. So who else? Um, guys, if you can help me turning on your cameras, me pueden ayudar encendiendo sus cameras, por favor. Perfect. Thank you. So guys, um, you know, I'm going to, I know that you have, um, uh, well, with that we are learning English because but you know, I'm going to speak English almost all the time so you can improve. Voy a estar hablando inglés para que ustedes mejoren su oído, that's listening, okay? So, of course, if you don't understand it, uh, something, si no tienen algo, you can ask me, okay? Pueden preguntar. So now, guys, let's start with the class of today. First of all, let me share you the screen. Déjeme compartirles la pantalla. Share the screen. Um, we are going to talk about the previous thing that we made yesterday, okay? We were discussing about positives, right? And personal pronouns. We were talking about this, okay? So now, I want you to help me, okay? Necesito que me ayuden. So... In the chat box, in the chat box, please tell me what is the correct answer for this one. So we have they. What is the possessive of they? Is letter A, B, C, or D? Help me, please, in the chat box. In the chat, pueden escribir cuál es la respuesta correcta, okay? So I have they, B, 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 okay? They say, Jonathan and Jose say B, okay? What about the rest? Okay, Maria say B. Okay. So let's see. Perfect. B. Okay. So in this case, they, the positive is there. Perfect. That one there. So that's nice. Now let's see the second one. Okay. I have I. I. Okay. I. Where is the correct one for I? Is letter A, B, C, or D? Help me, guys, in the chat box. I use them in the chat box. Okay, it's clear. Okay, I have A, B, A, 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 okay. Letter A. And what about the rest? I want to see the rest, okay? I have how many? Well, we are eight today. That's nice. Perfect. We are more than the previous class. So that's very nice. So there are new here. So perfect, guys. For I, we have... My, right? Yo, mío, correcto? Yo, mío. So an example, recordemos, puedo decir, I am a teacher, right? Yo soy un doctor. An example with my, my cell phone, okay? My cell phone. So perfect. Now let's move on, guys. We have you. What do you think? Help me in the chat box, please. Help me in the chat box. You. Is A, B, C, or D? What do you think? Okay. Okay, I have here, it says, okay, B, C, okay. C, what else, guys? What do you think? It's B or, or is C? Letter B or letter C? For you, the positive of you. Tell me, guys. Okay, C, C. Okay, 
Perfect. So yeah, the possessive of you is your, okay? Your, okay? It is no your, it's your, okay? Your. Perfect. Now we have he. He, for he, what do we have? He is letter A, B, C, or D. Which one? Okay. So I have C, C, okay. Yeah, for he, remember, is his, right? He, he significa él, right? He, he, his, significa suyo, es su de él, ¿verdad? Suyo. Perfect, his. Now, she, she, for, for she, what do we have? ¿Qué tenemos para she? Okay, I have, <laughs> yeah. Okay, perfect, yeah. So for she, we have hair, hair. And hair significa su, pero de ella, ¿verdad? Su de ella. Perfect. And we have it, it. What do we have for it? Mm -hmm, guys, what do you think? D, they say D, right? So for it, we have it, right? It, perfect. Now we have we, we. What do we have for we? What do you think, guys? Okay. David say B, okay. Jose B. Okay, perfect. So yeah, we, we significa nosotros, right? And we have this one, our. Our significa de nosotros, ¿verdad? De nosotros. For example, our English class, okay? Our English class. Perfect. And the last one. Well, we have already done this one, right? So, perfect, guys. So, well, this was, you know, part of the uh, class from yesterday. So, for the ones that were not here yesterday, welcome. First of all, welcome. Para los que nos dieron ayer, bienvenidos, right? And we were discussing about personal pronouns and possessive, right? So, well, besides that, guys, aparte de eso, teníamos una tarea, right? Uh, necesito que me levanten la mano. ¿Quién es? Raise your hand. ¿Quién es terminar la tarea? Raise your hand. Okay. Perfect. Okay, that's very nice. Perfect. So, let me share you the screen, guys. One second. Okay, I have this one. Okay, tenemos esto, okay? So, esta era la tarea de ayer, right? So, it was this one, right? Hello, what's your name? So, it say hi. ¿Cuál iba aquí, chicos? ¿Cuál era la respuesta para los que lo hicimos? Hi. My name is... Perfect, that one. Now, it is my, ¿verdad? My name is... I'm done, right. And now we have this one. What's her name? And it say name is Nicole. So what was the answer here? Her name is Nicole. Perfect. Her name is Nicole, right? Nice. And for this one, para esta, what his name? Name is Michael. ¿Cuál era, chicos? His. Perfect. His name. His name, his, his name. is Michael, right? Michelle. Perfect. So that was the homework, right? Esa era la primera parte que íbamos a terminar del módulo. So, well, if you didn't finish, si no terminaron, igual, bueno, ya aquí pueden hacerlo, right? So you can do this one. So now, perfect. Now let's move on, guys. Okay. So for today's class, where well, we are going to finish, you know, desde ya les estoy adelantando, vamos a terminar esto, esta tarea y esta. Esta es casi similar a la anterior, ¿verdad? Y esta, ¿ok? So this one will be about numbers. So do not worry. It's really easy. Es bastante sencillo. Solo son tres ejercicios, ¿ok? Bastante fácil. So do not worry. Everything will be really easy, ¿ok? Todo va a estar muy fácil. So perfect, guys. Now let me move on, you know. We are going to watch some things before the start to begin, ¿ok? Let me share you the presentation for today. Déjame compartirles la presentación. 
Okay. So, perfect. So, aquí, chicos, uh, tenemos, bueno, lo que estamos viendo, ¿verdad? ¿Qué significa cada personal pronoun, right? I, yo, you, tú, he, she, he, el, perdón, he, el, she, ella. So, you see, right? And we have this, right? Um, I send you this presentation to the WhatsApp group, right? Let's mandé esto al grupo de WhatsApp. So, you can check it. Now, guys, we are going to see this one, right? So you, you know what is this, right? The alphabet. So we are going, you know, to use the alphabet for today, right? So now I want you guys to turn on your cameras, okay? Your cameras, because we are going to practice. And what I'm going to see, uh, I'm going to see you here. I mean, practice it with me, okay? Voy a estarlos viendo mientras practicamos, okay? Please keep your microphone off, okay? Mantén, mantenga sus micrófonos off. So, let's see, okay? So, let's start with the first one. So, we have this one, letter A, okay? Letter A, you can see the pronunciation here, okay? A, so repeat, A, A. Now we have B, B, okay? A, B. Perfect. Now we have C. Letter C. Okay. Now we have D. E. F. G. H. I. J. K. L. M. N O P Q R S T U B W X Y and Z. Okay, Z like zero, right? Like como zebra, zebra. Okay, Z. Perfect, guys. So now let's see what do we have here, okay? Um, I have here this exercise. So I want a volunteer first. Do I have a volunteer, a voluntario, a volunteer? Raise your hand if I have a volunteer on Zoom. A volunteer? Yes, no? Okay, David, say. Okay, David, help me. Can you read this for me, please? Puedes leer eso para mí. Okay, how do you spell your name? Perfect. So, spell. Do you know what is this question in Spanish, David? Can yes. you can you read for the class in Spanish? Como deletreas tu nombre? Perfect. So, how do you spell your name, guys? Es como deletreas tu nombre. Okay. Como se deletrea. So now, David, can you help me spelling your name? Me puedes ayudar deletreando tu nombre? Okay. My name is David. Okay. D H A B I D. Perfect. Congratulations. That's nice. Perfect. Thank, Thank you, David. You. Now let's see, because we are 10, right? So who wants to be the next one? Mm -hmm. You can tell me. Okay. Next one. Okay. I was volunteer or big team. <laughs> okay. So now let's choose someone. So I have here a uh, Jorge. So Jorge Lopez, I need your help, please. So Jorge, can you help me spelling your name, please? My name is Jorge. Okay. J O R G E. G E. Perfect, Jorge. That's nice. Perfect. Flowers. Thank you. Now let's see, we have uh, Jonathan Erasso. So Jonathan, hello. So can you help me, Jonathan, spelling your name, please? My name is Jonathan. J-O-M-A-T-H-A-N. Perfect, Jonathan. Thank you, congrats. Thank you. Now I have here a uh, Jose Monge that I know that you're moving your camera. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Okay, Jose, 
Can you help me spelling your name, please? <laughs> J O S I. Perfect. Thank you, Jose. Thank you. Okay. Now I have here a uh, Maria. Maria, can you help me spelling your name, please? My name is Maria. M A R I E A. Perfect. Thank you, Maria. Thank you. Now we have here a uh, Jose. A, the other Jose, a 52, it's saying. So, Jose, can you help me read your name, please? My name is Jose. J O S E. Thank you, Jose. Thank you. Now we have a Juan Jose. So, Juan, can you help me spelling your name, please? Hi, my name is Juan. J U A N. Thank you, Juan. Thank you. Now we have a uh, Jose Araujo. Hello. I think this is your first class, so welcome. So, Jose, can you help me spelling your name, please? J O S E. Thank you, Jose. Thank you. Now we have a uh, Freddy. Freddy, oh, sorry. Freddy, can you help me spelling your name, please? Ah, uh, Freddy, your microphone is off. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. My name is Freddy. Uh, F R I D Y. Thank you, Freddy. Thank you very much. Okay. So I think we are done, right? Si, todos pasamos. Si, perfect. So now let me move on to this one, okay? So we have this conversation here, okay, guys? So First of all, uh, what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do, guys, uh, is that I'm going to send you something. Well, first of all, lo que quiero, chicos, es que le tomen una captura de pantalla o una foto a este mensaje, a este uh, diapositiva, please, if you can take it. Because I know that some of you are not in the WhatsApp group, so if you can take it, please. Uh, lo que vamos a hacer, chicos, es lo siguiente, okay? Déjenme... Perfect. Okay, igual se va a hacer, voy a mandar al grupo de WhatsApp. Voy a abrir, uh, voy a separar a los chicos en grupos para que practiquemos esto, ¿ok? Esta. ¿Cómo se pronuncia todo esto, ok? So, vamos a dividirlos en grupos de dos o tres y vamos a practicar, ¿ok? Así que no tengan miedo. Don't be afraid. So, first of all, let me help you with this one, ¿ok? Let me help you. So, the pronunciation, la pronunciación es así. What's your short name? What's your short name? Smith. How do you spell your name? It's S M I T H. What's your first name? Fred. How do you spell your first name? It's F R E D. Where are you from? Chimbote and cash. Okay. So now, guys, I'm going to divide you. Let's be divided in a breakable. Okay. So we are 10. So perfect. So, yeah. Perfect. Let me create the breakable rooms. I'm going to assign you. Okay. So, bueno, uno, uno va a quedar de tres chicos, but do not worry. Okay. Si pueden aceptar, ya les cae una solicitud. Si pueden aceptar, Vamos a practicar esto, ¿ok? In the breakout rooms. I'm going to send you as well a picture so you can practice, ¿ok? If you can accept it. Ok. Ok. Uh, perfect. Nice. Okay, guys, do you have any question? Tiene alguna pregunta? No. No. Okay, bueno, este grupo queda de tres porque eh, ya no habían, ¿verdad? Así que pueden practicar 
al grupo de WhatsApp les mandé igual esta imagen y el que le tomaron ustedes fotos para que practiquen, ¿ok? So practice, ¿ok? You can divide each other, ¿ok? Pueden dividirse quién va primero y quién, ¿ok? So I'm going to come back, ¿ok? Voy a regresar para ver cómo van, ¿ok? So okay. let me move on. Nay, Smith. Smith. Ajá, Smith. Ah, pero. Eso ya me toca a mí. What do you expect your name? It is. Is. A... Okay. Are you practicing, guys? Está practicando. Oh. Uh, do you take the picture, right? En el grupo de WhatsApp igual se les mandé la picture para que practiquen. Hey. Yes, if you can practice, please. Okay, guys, um, are you practicing? Hello? Hi. Hola. Hi, ¿están practicando? No. Eh, bueno, es, no sé si en el grupo de WhatsApp ya les mandé la, la foto para que practiquemos, ¿ok? Eh, igual ustedes, no sé si le tomaron foto. Yes, please, because this is for practice, ¿ok? So, thank you. I'm going to return, okay? Voy a regresar para ver cómo vamos, okay? So, let's see this one. Si quieres, yo empiezo ahorita. Bueno. What's your short name? Smith. How do you spell your name? It's, it's M. Where are you from? Chimbote and Cash. Se escucha. Yes, I can hear you. Al parecer él no me escucha, el compañero. Oh, really? Oh my god. Well, do not worry, guys. Um I'm, I'm going to close now the breakout rooms because time is over, so you can come back, okay? okay. So perfect. Hello. Hi, welcome back. So let's see, we are here again. So we are going okay. to wait for the rest. Vamos a esperar a los demás guys that they are coming. So let me share you the screen, okay? So perfect. So we have this one, right? This is screen. 
So, well, uh, they are waiting, okay? They will be here in 30 seconds. So, okay, guys, I need you to help me with this, okay? Ya que estamos para mientras nosotros dos, necesito que me ayude, okay? David and Jorge. I need you to, David, <coughs> you have to be A, okay? David was the primero y Jorge el segundo, okay? So, okay. please, uh, if you can help me reading this, please. Okay. What's your surname? Smith. How do you spell your, your name? It's S-M-I-T-H. H, perdón, H. Okay. What's your first name? Friend. How do you spell your first name? If, if, R, E, D. Where are you from? Simbol, Akash, Akash. Okay. Perfect. So uh, that was really nice. Now I need another volunteers. So let's have, vamos a tener a uh, Maria. If you can help me con letter A, Maria. You are going to be letter A. And your partner, tu compañero va a ser Freddy Espinosa, okay? Freddy, you are going to be letter B, okay? Vos vas a ser letter B. So, Maria, if you can help me reading this one, please. Maria? What is your name, family? Probably your short name or family name, okay. Freddy, if you can help me. Uh, your microphone is off. <laughs> yeah, sorry. It's okay. Uh, repeat, repeat. Yeah, see, bueno, Maria va a ser letter A. Y you are going to be letter B, ¿ok? Ella va a decir todo la letra A y tú la letra B, ¿ok? Sí. Ok. Now. Yeah. María, can you start again, please? Puedes repetirlo de nuevo, María. Yes. What is your name? Family name. Your short name, ¿ok? It's me. What do you expect your name? Is. Is. Um, I, T, H. What is your first name? Fred. What do you expect your first name? Is F, R, I, D. Where are you from? Chimbote and Cash. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you for your participation. Okay, guys, um, let me help you with this. Okay, let me get this one next. Okay, so tenemos la primera pregunta is what's your short name? Okay, mm -hmm. necesito que repitan. If you can turn off, turn off, apaguen sus micrófonos y quiero que repitan desde su casa. Okay, solo la cámara necesito que tenga activada para yo verlos. Okay, so repeat after me, please. What's your short name? Okay. Short name, okay, short name. It's a, a Smith. Ahora, how do you spell your name? Okay, ¿cómo deletreas tu nombre? It's S M I T H. Okay. Ahora, what's your first name? What's your first name? What's your first name? Perfect. Now, Fred. How do you 
spell your first name. How do you spell your first name? Okay, nice. It's F F R E D. Okay. And where where are you from? From okay, from. And you can say chimbote, right? Chimbote. <laughs> That's called chimbote. Perfect, guys. Okay, so we have this one, right? Now we are going to move. Okay, nos vamos a mover, chicos. Now we are going to make something else. Okay, ya practicamos. We practice speaking. Okay, speaking. Now we are going to practice listening. Okay, listening. So I have an hour here for you. Okay, tengo un hour uh, listening for you. So please. This is the thing that we are going to do. Esto es lo que vamos a hacer, chicos. I'm going to play the audio, and you are going to type on the chat box of Zoom the answer, okay? So, voy a reproducir el audio, chicos, y en el chat de Zoom, quiero que me escriban lo que escuchen, okay? La respuesta. La respuesta eh, al audio. El audio le va a decir un nombre y se lo va a deletrear. Quiero que ustedes escriban el nombre que escuchen, okay? So let's hear, okay? I'm going to play the hour. How do you spell the names? Listen and check the correct answers. One. Your name is John Lee? That's right. And how do you spell your first name, Mr. Lee? How do you spell your first name? How do you spell? Como de letras. How do you spell? It's J-O-N. Okay. Okay, so we have the first name. Let me play you one more time. One. Your name is John Lee? That's right. And how do you spell your first name, Mr. Lee? It's J-O-N. Okay, so you can send the answer, guys. Okay, John, okay, Maria John Lee, okay. So John, John. Okay, what about the rest? Okay, have it here. Correct. So it, he said, el dice, J O N, John. Perfect. Now let's see number two, guys. Okay. Thank you. Two. Sarah Brown. Your first name is spelled S A R A H? No. My name is. Mm. Sorry, it looks like the audio stopped. So let's see. Okay, Sarah Browns. Okay, I have Sarah. Uh, guys, let me ask you something. Can you hear something? Pueden escuchar? Can you hear? No. Well, I know what no. I know. Okay, let me see what happened. Okay, do not worry. But yeah, the name was Sarah. Thank you, Maria. I, well, she got it. Maria got it. So do not worry, guys, okay? But let me show you this one, okay? Let me show you, okay. F, okay, this one, okay? This exercise, este ejercicio, lo tenemos aquí, ¿verdad? Lo tenemos igual en nuestro módulo, okay? So we have it here. It's the last one. It's, it's the last one. It's el último. So we have this listening, okay? We have here the listening, okay? So you are going to hear, well, it's this one, sorry. This one. Uh, we have the listening, guys, and you are going to uh, hear an answer, okay? For example, we have the first one. Tenemos el primero, right? So then we have the second one, the third one, Four, one, and fifth one. Okay, tenemos cinco. We have five in order to spell. Okay, so you have the area and you have to understand. Okay, so now that we have this one, let me move on. Okay, déjenme mover y déjenme compartirles la diapositiva de PowerPoint presentation. So let's see. Uh, 
Okay. Perfect. So now let me move on to this one. Okay. So we have verb to be. Okay. Uh, have you ever heard about this one, guys? Ya han escuchado acerca del verbo to be? So probably yes, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can see that some of you say yes. Okay. So this one, guys, is verb to be. Okay. We have the verb to be here. So we have affirmative negative interrogative, okay? So we have as affirmative, uh, we have this one, okay? Uh, let me just do something. Um, well, affirmative, we have I, you know what is I, right? I, you, he, she, it, right? Then we have this one. For affirmative, we have for I, we have am, okay? Am. You, we have are. For he, we have is. She, it, as well, they have is, right? For we, we have are. You, again, are. They are, okay? So, in few words, guys, en pocas palabras, chicos, déjenme explicarles. So, I, siempre va a ir con am, okay? Always will be with am. And ¿qué significa esto? What does it mean? The verb to be means, significa ser o estar, ¿ok? Ser o estar. Estas son las dos cosas que ustedes tienen que saber. Por ejemplo, en affirmative, positivo. I am a doctor. Yo soy un doctor, ¿ok? I am a doctor. I am a doctor. O yo puedo decir, I am in the hospital. I am in the hospital. Yo estoy en el hospital, ¿verdad? Ser y estar, ¿se dan cuenta? I am a doctor, I am in the hospital. So you see? I am, yo soy, I am, yo estoy, ¿ok? Now we have you are. Para los demás chicos significa lo mismo, ser y estar. Si yo te digo, o yo les digo, you are my friend, tú eres mi amigo. Y si yo les digo, you are in your house, tú estás en tu casa, right? You are my friend, eres mi amigo. You are in your house. Tú estás en tu casa. So you see, ser y estar, okay? And now we have this one. He, she, and it. They will be always with is, okay? Is. He is, she is, it is, okay? We are, you are, they are, okay? Recordemos, para la tercera persona, he, she, and it, va a ir is siempre, okay? Y para el resto, we, you, and they, Van a ser are, ok, are. Y solo para I, que significa yo, vamos a utilizar am, ok. Hasta aquí todo entendido. Yes, no. Yeah. Well, if I'm too fast, guy, you can tell me. Si, si voy muy rápido, ustedes pueden decirme, ok, teacher, can you explain one more time, please? So I'm going to do it, ok, lo voy a repetir. So tenemos para positivo, ok. Affirmative, I am, you are. So now we have negative. Tenemos para negativo, para decir algo que no, right? So si el verbo to be significa ser y estar, aquí sería no soy o no estoy, right? For example, I am not a doctor. I am not a doctor. No soy un doctor. I am not in the hospital. No estoy en el hospital, okay? ¿Se dan cuenta? No soy, no estoy, right? I am not. You are not my friend. Tú no eres mi amigo. You are not my friend. You are not in your house. Tú no estás en tu casa. You are not in your house. And we have this, one, right? So we have, I am not. You are not. He is not. She's not. It is not. We are not. You are not. They are not, okay? Negative. So now, guys, I want you to ask you something. Uh, but hasta aquí, everything is clear, right? Everything is clear so far. Todo está claro ahorita, right? So perfect, guys. So now we have interrogative. And what is interrogative? Interrogative is for questions, right? So for question, what we are going to do, lo que vamos a hacer es mover el, ah, bueno, el verbo to be va a ir de primero, okay? It's going to be the first one. So we have here, am I, okay? First is the verb to be, and then is the personal pronoun, okay, the subject. So you see that, first of all, here in the affirmative, subject first, then verb to be. 
Negative, subject first, then verb to be, and not. But in interrogative, the verb to be must to be the first one, okay? This is the verb to be. It must to be at the beginning. Debe estar al principio. So, am I, are you, is he, is she? Interrogative mean questions. Questions means preguntas, okay? Si yo les pregunto, are you a doctor? Are you a doctor? Eres un doctor? Y si les preguntara, are you in your house? Estás en tu casa? Are you in your house? Okay. So you see, guys, now, you know, before to continue, let me share you another presentation. Déjenme ponerles otra presentación para que más o menos entendamos, okay? So, no se preocupen, chicos. Verb to be is easy, okay? It's only, solo significa ser y estar, okay? So now let me move on, sorry. Let me move on, okay? So we have verb to be, okay? We have here some examples, okay? So tenemos, decíamos que para yo, I, es I am. Y la contractación, the contraction means am, okay? Ustedes pueden decir am. I am significa am, okay? Am, am, okay? Can you repeat in your house, please? Pueden repetir en su casa, am, okay? Am, traten de pronunciar. La M, right? Am, um, am, um, am, um, am um significa yo soy o yo estoy, ok? Si ustedes tienen un cuadernito y que para anotar cosas, pues sería bueno que lo anoten, ¿verdad? Para que no se les olvide por si acaso lo tienen. So, am um, significa yo soy o yo estoy. Am um, or I am. Ahora tenemos she. She is. O podemos decir she's, she's, okay, she's, or she is. She is significa ella es o ella está. Ahora tenemos you are, you are, lo podemos decir también como you are, you are, you are, okay. Significa tú eres o tú estás, right. Ahora tenemos it is, it is, okay. It is. Es como, aquí le puedo ayudar, chicos, esta T que vemos aquí, tratémosla de pronunciar como una R, ¿ok? Una R unida con esta. It is, it is, como el nombre it is, right? It is, it is, right? It is. Podemos decir it is o it's, it's, ¿ok? It's. Ahora tenemos he. He is or his, his, ¿ok? Now, well, we have this one, right? We are, we are, we are. You are, well, you are. They are, they're, they're, okay? Now, tenemos para la negativa, ¿verdad? Para las negativas, solo vamos a decirlo siempre. I am not, she is not, you are not, it is not, okay? So, we have... Para interrogativas, ¿ok? I, am I, are you, is she, is it, is he, ¿ok? And, bueno, ¿cuándo lo usamos? It says that we use it to say who we are, who we are, quiénes somos. So, an example, Brad Pitt is an actor, ¿ok? Brad Pitt is an actor. Brad Pitt es un actor, ¿ok? Es un actor. So, Brad Pitt, ocupamos el verbo to be is, porque is lo ocupamos solo para he, she, and it. Y he es él, right? So, Brad Pitt is he. Perfect. Now, we have to talk about weather. Weather. So, it says, it is very cold today. Es bastante frío hoy, right? It is very cold. Now, to talk about time. So, tenemos la pregunta la más famosa, right? the most famous question. What time is it? What time is it? Okay, what time is it? So, now, también para hablar de places, right? Places, you know, significan lugares, right? Lugares. We have the Amazon River is in Canada. Is in, chicos, let me move on. Is in, aquí no está, but 
isn't significa is not, ¿ok? Is not. Ustedes lo pueden también decir así. Isn't, ¿ok? Isn't. Isn't or is not. So the Amazon River isn't in Canada. El río de las Amazonas no está in Canada, ¿ok? So also we can use it to talk about feelings. So she is angry. She's angry. Ella está enojada, right? She's angry. También acerca de las edades de las personas. For example, si yo les pregunto, how old are you? Ustedes dicen, I'm or I am. It is decent to that, right? 44 years old, 25, right? And well, that's all about the verb to be that I have here. So, well, here I have this, right? The structure, como decía, primero va el sujeto, the subject, verb to be, and the complement, right? El complemento. So we have this one, right? Subject, verb to be. I am happy, you are happy, he is happy, right? Yo, I am happy, yo soy feliz, o yo soy feliz, right? So we have this one. We have, I am Tom. I am 35 years old. I am happy. I am from America. I am a police officer, okay? So who is he, chicos? Si les pregunto who is he, ¿quién es él? ¿Cómo respondería? In the Spanish, él es Tom. In English, how do you say it? ¿Cómo lo dicen? Él es Tom. He is Tom. He is Tom. Perfect. Okay, so let's see. Perfect. Where is Tom from? ¿De dónde es Tom? Where is Tom from? So tell me, well, Tom was from America, right? So, ¿cómo dirían? Él es de América. Él es de América. Él es? He is from America. He is from America. Perfect. So you see? Okay, how does Tom feel? ¿Cómo se siente Tom? Él decía que estaba feliz. So, ¿cómo vamos a decir? Él está feliz. O él es feliz. He's happy. He's, He's happy. happy. He's happy. He's happy. Perfect. Thank you. So, you see, guys, easy, right? Bastante fácil, right? So, hasta aquí, chicos. ¿Alguna pregunta acerca del verb to be? Yes, no. 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 ¿Todo clarito? ¿Listo para un examen sorpresa? <laughs> no, right? <laughs> okay, do not worry. No, we are not going to get an exam. Do not worry. So, okay, let's move on then. Movámonos entonces. So, tenemos este. Okay, tenemos el verbo to be. Aquí tenemos unas oraciones, okay? So, I need a volunteer for this one to help me read it. So, I have a volunteer here. Volunteer? Yes, no? Or a victim? Yes, okay, I have a Jose Monge. Perfect. Can you help me read in this sentence, please, Jose? Puedes ir dame leer el primero, this one. Sure, I am Jennifer Miller. Perfect, I'm Jennifer Miller. And in Spanish, yo soy Jennifer Miller, right? Perfect. Yeah. Now, I want, uh, let me choose another one, would you choose? So, Jorge, can you help me read in this, this one? Yo, I, my, my class. You're in my class. So, tú estás en mi clase, right? You are in my class, or you are in my class. Perfect. Now, let's move on to Jose Aranjo. Can you help me reading this? Puedes ayudarme leyendo solo esta. She's in our class. She's in our class. Perfect. Thank you. Now, uh, Freddy, can you help me reading this for me, please? Puedes ir dame leyendo esta. Uh, the microphone is soft, right? If you. <laughs> yeah, he is over there. Over there, perfect. So he's over there means él está ahí, verdad? He's over there. Over there es como ahí, verdad? He's over there. Perfect. Now, Jonathan, 
Can you help me reading this, please? It is my math book. Math book. Thank you. Now we have here um, Jose A52. Can you help me reading this, please? It's Miller. It's Miller. Thank you. So S. Miller, right? Perfect. Now, uh, let's see. We have Maria. Can you help me reading this, please? Are you Steven Carson? Are you Steven Carson? Perfect. So it's a pregunta, right? Tú eres Steven Carson? Are you Steven Carson? Thank you, Maria. So now, and we have the last question. Fred, David, sorry. Can you help me read this, please? Hey, how are you? I'm fine. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, in this one, es la más común, ¿verdad? How are you? ¿Cómo estás? How are you? Usted dice, I am fine. I am happy. I am good. Okay. Yo estoy bien. Yo estoy feliz. Perfect, guys. And we have the contractions, right? The contractions. I'm, I am. You are, you are, right? So, perfect. Okay, guys. So, now, let me move on. You know, let me move over. So, now, I'm going to show you the platform. Okay, guys. Les voy a mostrar la plataforma. Uh, let me ask you something. Déjenme preguntarles algo. ¿Quiénes? Todos tenemos acceso, right? A la plataforma, right? ¿Hay alguno que no tenga acceso? No. Okay, perfect. So, guys, let me show you the platform. So, perfect. We have it here, okay? Tenemos aquí la plataforma, right? So, this exercise was for today, right? This one. This is the first one. Now, for next class, we, are, we must finish this one, okay? Tenemos que terminar esta, okay? So, this one is about, you know, spelling names, okay? So, you see? Is the thing that we saw today. Es lo que vimos hoy, right? Como spell name. Van a tener el listening ahí y lo van a poder contestar. Aparte de eso, chicos, vamos a tener este otro ejercicio, okay? So, in this one, say, Excuse me, are you Steven Carson? No. ¿Cómo responderían aquí, chicos? No. I'm not. I'm not. No, I... I am not, right? Perfect. Y aquí igual. My name, David Medina. ¿Cuál sería aquí? Which one? Is. My name is, right? And we have a Steven. A Steven is here, right? So, a Steven. Recordemos. He, is, right? El verbo to be. Aquí vamos a utilizar el verbo to be. We are going to use verb to be. So, we are going to add is, right? In this one, you, Steven Carson, tenemos you, verdad? You. Uh, are, yes. perfect. No, it's because we are using you, right? Are you, okay, are you, okay? Hi, in this one. Yes. She. Well, she, um, Let's see. Yes, she. Well, but you know, guys, uh, we have this one, right? We have this exercise that will be for tomorrow. Okay, tenemos este. Eh, tenemos el último, right? This one. This is the last one. So in this case, it's about numbers, right? Acerca de numbers, right? So in this case, um, we all know about numbers, right? Phone numbers, number from one to zero, right? Ya sabemos los números en inglés, right? Yes. So I hope so. So, vamos a hacer una pequeña dinámica con los números, ¿ok? Números en inglés. So I need David. David, I need you to tell yes. me. Yeah. Necesito que me digas. Uh, what is your phone number? Tell me what's your phone number in English. Okay, my phone number is seven six five eight. Six six eight three. Perfect. Nice. Now, guys, uh, you see, it's easy, right? Son bastante fácil los los números, right? So now let me show you something here. Okay. Well, no, it, it doesn't. No me deja compartir pantalla, but it's okay. So 
Ahora, let me ask you, let's see, uh, Jorge. Jorge, can you tell me what is your phone number? Lo pueden inventar, chicos, it's okay. What's your phone number? My number is uh, 737-6967. Thank you. So, les estoy preguntando a estos chicos porque probablemente es algo que ustedes tienen en la cabeza, ¿verdad? Y ustedes están pensando, how do you say siete in English? Ah, seven, right? So, now let's see, Maria. Maria, tell me um, your phone number. It can be invented, right? You can invent the phone number, but tell me. It, recuerden que el número de teléfono tiene que tener ocho dígitos, right? So, let's see. Eh, sería mm -hmm. six... Nine, nine, nine. El cero, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Okay, guys, ¿cómo se pronuncia el cero? Zero. Zero, zero. zero. yeah, you, you pronounce zero, zero. <laughs> yeah. Más zero, mm -hmm. five. Yes. Seven. Yeah. Nine. Perfect. Thank you. So now let's move on to Jonathan. Jonathan, tell me a phone number. Dime un número de teléfono. Uh, seven, six, two, one, five, three, nine, four. Perfect. Now let's move on to Jose Monge. I know you are there. <laughs> so Jose Monge, tell me your phone number or whatever phone. <coughs> Seven seven four four two eight zero one seven. Perfect. Thank you. Now let's move on to Juan Jose. Juan Jose, tell me a phone number. Yes, seven five one four eight nine six zero. Perfect. Now Freddy Espinosa, tell me a phone number, please. Seven seven five eight one six nine six. Perfect. Now, Jose Araujo. Two, two, five, seven, 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 seven. Okay, thank you. <laughs> now, the, well, Jose, the last one. Two, three, two, two, zero, two, six, three. Perfect. Okay, guys. Now, before finishing, antes de terminar, yo le voy a decir un número de teléfono, okay? I need you to write, ¿ok? Necesito que lo escriban o pueden escribirlo en el chat de Zoom, ¿ok? Vamos a ver que también está listening, ¿ok? Vamos a ver que también, ¿ok? So, ¿ok? Let me know whenever you're ready. So, it's ¿ok? One second. ¿Ok? So, ¿ok, chicos? Aquí está el número de teléfono. Pay attention. It's Seven three zero two five six four. Okay, tenemos the key that David. Okay, vamos a ver. Let's see. Hey, perfect. Yeah, you got it. So, vamos a ver los demás. Se escribieron el mismo número. You can type it. Okay, perfect. I like it, guys. Me gusta. So, now let me give you another phone number, okay? Bastante sense. Bueno, le voy a dar un año, okay? Vamos a ver si nos podemos. 200. Uh, yeah, 200. 200. 200. 200. Okay, two hundred. Okay, okay, okay. So, two hundred guys significa. Okay, estoy viendo que está mandando todavía. Well, two hundred son perfect. Jose Monge and David Guerra. Two hundred son doscientos. Okay, doscientos. Dos cero cero, right? Two zero zero. Okay. Mil dos mil es two. Thousand, okay, two thousand. But do not worry, we are going to see about numbers next class. Okay, vamos a ver the number, the numbers 
next class, okay? But for tonight, guys, por hoy, class is over, okay? Eh, bueno, vamos a terminar eh, con estos ejercicios que les he dejado. Vamos a terminar en la sección 1 del módulo, okay? La sección 1 es nice to meet you, right? Eh, para mañana ya debe estar terminado, right? Ustedes pueden terminarlo en todo el transcurso, pero para mañana ya debe estar, ok? Porque mañana vamos a iniciar con la sección número 2, ok? Y no quiero que se atrasen. So that's why mañana, y como mañana igual se tiene que calificar después de la clase, si sí pueden terminarlo, ok? Eh, um, pueden incluso continuar ahorita, pueden hacerlo ahorita si, si gustan al terminar la clase, pueden terminar, porque es bastante corto, chicos. Ahorita que van frescos de la mente, right? You're fresh. So you can finish. And tomorrow nos vemos. Pero ahí si tienen alguna pregunta, háganmela saber o escriban al WhatsApp, okay? Al, al grupo. So thank you so much for being here today, guys. And you're a, you made a good job, okay? Hicieron un buen trabajo el día de hoy. I like it. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Espero verlos mañana, okay? So thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye. See bye. You tomorrow. bye. 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 Take care, guys. Bye. Bye-bye.